Gorilla Tank's new spring flashback is finally here, and here's everything you need to know. I always make these videos before the update comes out so I can tell you what's coming in the game before it actually happens. If this prediction is right, then you have to like this video, like you have to with a T. Gorilla Tank's gonna be having a flashback sale, meaning anything you see in this shop that's empty right now is gonna be completely full with new flashback items that you need to spend your real life money on. So right now, like I said, as you can see, it's empty. We need a new balloon. But as you can see, the most of the update already did happen. There's new flowers, obviously, the new M shop. They have decorated both second, first and second floor. Pretty cool. I also, I like what they've done with the place. You know, they've decorated this table a little bit more with new flowers and the whole thing. Oh, I love my chocolate bunny too. So I'm so hyped to see what's going to be in this next shop because they're going to be having a spring flashback. So anything that you missed out on last year's oh, will all be here and they will be using the second floor as well for the majority of the ones from two years ago. So they'll be having ones from last year and from two years ago decorated with these big pink, bright, blooming flowers. Why did I say it like that, bro? That's weird. But no, there's nothing on the second floor yet as I'm making this video. And the third floor will not be used, sadly enough. We'll not be seeing any new gold masks. Should I buy this? Probably not, right? This is a bad purchase. Why are you back here? I hope for the most part you guys have some shiny rock saved up because if you don't, it's gonna be rough. There's a lot of new cosmetics. And right now, my artillery, wait, my artillery, my locker room is a little empty. I finally got the bunny and the cake, so I am a happy man. Also, you can double bite them. <laughs> guys, I just found them. <laughs> we finally got Doug the Bug's babies and their mini versions scaled down of him. We've got Doug the Bug girlfriend skin and the normal Doug the Bug. Come here, boy. And if you try to grab Doug the Bug, these guys follow him intensely fast. So if you try to escape him, watch what happens. Oh my, oh, I just broke my controller. Well, anyways, they follow insanely fast. And what happens if Doug the Bug gets stung by a bee? Let's see. I'm sorry, Doug, I have to subject you to torture just for this analysis. Oh, they don't like Doug the Bug. Sorry, buddy. I don't know about you guys, I'm hyped for this update, but let's go see if you guys are hyped for this update. Wait, no, listen, 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 hello. Yep, and you're next. Bye, my homie. Okay, that was sketchy. I'm sorry that I have to end this video like this. It's terrible that I have to do it like this. But if you ever run into a lobby with someone saying he can ban you, he has a mod that allows him to change your username and basically ban you for a couple days. Like, he has that ability from a dark web mod menu. If you ever have someone threatening to kick you and they've kicked other people, it's a very dangerous situation for you because you can actually get potentially banned. Someone, I don't know if it's on video, but someone just did that in my last lobby, so I had to leave Gorilla Tag, come back into the lobby to finish this video. But just a disclaimer for anyone who's doing it, I don't know why you're doing it. You're a terrible person for it because you're just making the Gorilla Tag community worse. It might be fun for you at the moment, but as soon as you get banned, you can get a lifetime ban on Girl Tag. So, thank you all for watching this video, and I will see you all when the update comes out. Oh yeah, and the update comes out at 1 or 2 p.m. Central Time.